Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. This is a video explaining what I use on the road as an OTR driver to use the restroom number one. We're not talking about number two, we're talking about number one. Y'all excuse the nail. This one, I broke it. <laughs> um, but yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, um, and share this video just for other drivers who just, or even new drivers who are um, looking for another option. Now, let me, put this in here this is my own personal way I choose to use the restroom in emergency time of need or even during the winter time when I don't even want to get out the truck who gonna be walking in the snow to go piss not me so the items that I have to use the restroom that is to use num do number one is to use the uh to urinate is I keep a pack of red solo cups and I'm explain all these what I do with them after I tell you all the things that I use. Pack of red, I keep a pack of red solo cups. Hand sanitizer, of course. I keep these anyway. I keep this, I buy like three pack and I put one in my purse. I keep one on the truck. Um, and they just, just uh, flushables, uh, wet wipes, uh, rose water. And I got those off of Amazon. Um, I always keep a case of water on the truck, but really i'm just using this bottle just for the video um it's supposed to be empty but we just gonna pretend like it's empty it's empty bottle of water and of course i buy napkins um i don't use toilet tissue i just use napkins because these are cheaper um i get these from walmart they like 50 cent a roll i always get like six or eight of them at a time but yeah so what I do is to use the restroom in emergency time of needs or even during the winter time when it's nighttime and I have to use the urinate. Um, during the day, I drink bottles of water. So the bottles of water that I drink during the day, I um, keep the empty bottles. And I just keep them in a bag or I throw them back here in the back on my bed and keep them in the, um, in the corner lined up. And what I do is with these empty bottles of water, this is what I'm gonna pour my urine in once I use the red solo cup and I buy the pack of red solo cups because to me it's more sterile I can throw this in the trash at the end of the day because I use one a day I can throw this in the trash at the end of the day um it's to me it's more sanitized for something that's going down there and <clears throat> of course y'all know what I use the napkins for to wipe but I wipe with the wipes first and then I wipe with the napkins after I don't like to be wet I just like not what I don't need to be <laughs> TMI but I use the wipes first and then I wipe myself with the napkins so I tried the urinal the urinals to me they work out good in the little um what is it the the little cup things the little um, funnels those are good to use but it's just my preference not to use those because who want to be cleaning a urinal every time you use it not me it got to the point I tried the urinal and it was like, okay, I dump it out or whatever, or I pour it out or pour it into a water bottle like I did with, do with the cups. And it just like, it gets a, uh, if you don't clean it out that every day, it gets a smell, it smell like urine. I don't want urine to, and I had to keep it in a plastic bag. I didn't just let it sit around. Every time I got done using it, I would pour it out, spray um, um, bleach spray in it or whatever, pour a little water in it, rinse it out, throw it out, out the door or whatever. But then, who wants to be keep throwing piss outside the door? This way, when I piss in the solo, when I piss, when I urinate in the solo cups, <laughs> when I urinate in the solo cups, what I do is I take the this, pour it into the empty water bottle, and put the lid on the empty water bottle, and then I put it in one of these, I keep all my um, grocery bags. I put it in this grocery bag, or I use the bag that I use for the day with my trash, I put it in that, and then in the morning when I get ready to pull off or when I'm getting ready to get off to get fuel, I just throw the bag in the trash discreetly. Or I keep black trash bags. That's another thing you can keep, black trash bags. I put them in the black trash bag if you don't want nobody knowing your business, but everybody knows you piss on the goddamn truck. So what's the point? What, what, what is it you don't want them to know? <laughs> so, like I say, I, and then for those uh, emergency times, like when there's no truck stop or nothing around, or even when I go to a shipper or a receiver, and all they got is porta potties. Oh, girl, I don't use no porta potty. Mm -mm. I tell <laughs> one of the people had laughed at me because he was like, "I said this. I said y'all got restrooms." He's like, "Oh, we got us the porta potties outside." I was like, "I'd rather piss in the cup." 
And he just started laughing because I'm just so blunt. I'm like, I'm being serious. I'm about to go piss in the cup. Like, I'm not, I, I, who going to, what? I'm not about to squat over somebody else's shit. And they got to smell it. And then it's sitting out there in the heat. And it's just, ugh, just, we're not, we're not even going to get it. I'd rather go to my truck where I know it's clean. Pee in a sanitized cup. Use all the stuff that I need. And then I use my hand sanitizer afterwards when I'm done. Pour the piss pour the urine into an empty water bottle that only had water and I just drunk from for the day. Put it in the bag and throw it in the trash in the morning or when I get ready to pull off. I mean, that's the easiest process, the most easiest, clean, sanitized process I can think of. Now, some drivers, they have the um, the porta potties, the little things on the, the toilet things on the truck. But I don't want that. Where I don't have no room to put that. I barely got enough room to put my stuff. I don't want that. I don't want no freaking toilet on my darn truck. I mean, you only use it for emergencies, but I don't want that on my truck. Heck no. I'd rather just pull my pee in the darn bottle, seal it up, put it in a plastic bag, separate it from everything else, the truck. But that, I mean, you can keep the toilet on the side of the truck in one of your little, but then you got to get outside the truck, pull the toilet out. It's just a whole lot. You can keep it on the top bunk if you're just a solo driver. But I don't, me personally, I keep my top bunk up because I just like it more spacious in here, especially back here in the back. I'm always in the back when I'm stopped. Um, but yeah, that's just my preference. But like I say, um, I use the red solo cups, hand sanitizer, flushable wipes, um, bottle, an empty bottle of water, um, and then the napkins. And that's what I use to use the restroom in a time of emergency as an OTR female truck driver. Okay, y'all, so that's the end of this video. Thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, share this video so other new drivers can have a somewhat of a preference, uh, idea of what they need or what can, they can use as an OTR female truck driver over the road. Um, also, comment down below, females. Let me know what y'all use and what y'all preference to use. Do y'all use the urinal? Do y'all use my method or something similar to my method? Comment down below. Let me know what y'all use. Guys, y'all need to comment because we already know what y'all use. Y'all just get y'all a jug and call it a day. <laughs> but females, comment down below. Let me know what y'all preference is. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And thank you for watching.